Hello there then guys, DJ Harry here. This is your Thursday night. It's Friday tomorrow guys. Yay! Lots of great music come up to me now and at 10 o'clock tonight. But we're going to get the news first for you guys here on Jump Extra. The beat of Spreaker playing the best in dance club. House, new music, uh, hit music, and all over the best in remixes for you here on Spreaker. So, here's the news, and then we'll get on with the news. And go and we'll the channel. Then, a quick soldier, and but with my mate that Charlie CX do or a remix of that. Music's after the news. Hi, we're One Direction. Hey guys, this is Iggy Azalea. Hey, this is Avicii. I'm Naughty Boy. This is my station. From the Sky News Centre at 7, the government says the legal arguments now in place to allow Britain to take part in Western airstrikes on Islamic State in Syria. Earlier, the Defence Secretary Michael Fallon urged MPs to consider it, but said they'd be given a formal vote before any action took place. Meanwhile, it's believed authorities in Tunisia are about to bring charges in connection with last week's IS beach shooting in Sousse following a series of arrests. Government Minister there Kamal Jem Doubi has updated reporters on those in custody. Security units managed to uncover and destroy the network that was behind this operation. Right now, there are eight people that were arrested for direct links with the execution of this terrorist attack. Nine more British bodies were flown back from Seuss today. In all, 30 are in the process of being repatriated. Essex Police has referred itself to the police watchdog over the death of a notorious criminal who officers didn't realise had been shot. The body of John Palmer, nicknamed Goldfinger, was found by relatives in Brentwood last Wednesday, but his death was originally recorded as not suspicious because detectives missed the gunshot wounds to his chest. Five US states have welcomed an agreement with all giant BP to settle the Gulf of Mexico oil spill five years ago. The company will pay out £12 billion. That's a record sum. To tennis, and there's been more British success at Wimbledon today, although it's not all been good news. Live to Centre Court now, I'm Richard Newman. Yes, because Slovenian-born British number two, Aniaj Benene, is out in the second round. He's lost in four sets to 22nd seed Victor Troitsky, but Andy Murray easily beat Robin Haase, joined in the last 32 by James Ward, who got past Czech Yuri Vesely. And a cracking match on centre right now, Rafa Nadal struck against dreadlocked German Dustin Brown. It's one set all, but Nadal serving 5-3 down in the third. And the woman who played Maria on children's TV show Sesame Street for well over 40 years is retiring. Sonia Manzano is 65. That's the latest. I'm Tom Harrigan. Beautiful, and every night has a state so magical. And if there's love in this life, there's no obstacle that can't be defeated. For every tyrant to tee up all the vulnerable, in every loss, all so the bones of a miracle. For every dreamer, a dream were unstoppable with something to believe in. Monday left me broken Tuesday I was through with hoping Wednesday my empty arms were open Thursday waiting for love Waiting for love Thank the stars It's Friday I'm burning like a fire gone wild on Saturday Guess I won't be coming to church on Sunday I'll be waiting for love Waiting for love
Yummy. 